Ranking iconic 90s toys, guys. Ooh. All right, all right, all right. Adult yes. toys? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> sure. Uh, one of those things, I mean, like, I feel like you guys would know a lot about is, let's start with the first one. It's going to be... 90s toys. Mighty Max. Ooh, I love Mighty Max. You can start, Ricky. All right. And so, if you don't know it, Romy, I would just say I don't know. I don't know any of these toys. I was so poor, I don't have any of these. <laughs> you got right. the bootleg? Maybe Sea Sharks. Maybe make commercials. You go. <laughs> go ahead, Ricky. No, but Mighty dude, Max. Uh, the reason I. It's not the greatest toy. I'll tell you that. It's not the greatest toy, but the show. I used to love the show so much. Max, Virgil, Norman. Freaking awesome show. But that's why I got so into these. But as toys, they are, uh, it's like a Polly Pocket. I mean, that's what they are, essentially. Polly Pocket, too little. Yeah. Yeah. I just always lost them. I could never keep everything together. Even when you find them now, you're like, oh, it's just the, like, it mountain. It never has the figures Skull in it Mountain, no figures. Now we're ranking the toys, though, right? Not the show? Yeah. The toys, yeah. Okay. For me, what do, you, what do you give it, Rick? Uh, ooh, I didn't even get a score. Um, because I like it so much, I'm going to keep it at a B. Ricky's going to go, I have to rank these? <laughs> yeah, he's done it on the last two. Wait, we're ranking? <laughs> uh, I'll say C for me strictly because this, I actually would think they'd be an A if they were bigger. Because I do like Mighty Max and the branding. Yeah, the show, like you said, Ricky, was good. Toy-wise, I'd say it's like an E. I just did not like it. It didn't fit in my hand. It was so little. Uh, e for me. Nothing for you, Romeo, on this one? I have no clue. Dang. <laughs> <laughs> It's going to be just around this way. Ooh, baby, starting off low. Yeah, That's, yeah, a, yeah. Blow. That's a low blow. <laughs> that hurt. Let's see. Uh, talk Boy. Oh, I did own one of these. There you go. <laughs> there there you go. go. There right, you go. Right, start us off then. I'll give that an A for sure. Great movie. Fantastic play, thing to play with. I like the slow motion. Hello, Mr. Baby. I oh, love yeah, yeah. that toy. That I actually had a Talk Boy and a Talk Girl growing up. Jeez. They gave Dang. the talk to my sister, but I low-key kept it. Rich. <laughs> <laughs> Must have been nice to be rich, dude. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go A, dude. That was fantastic. Retro Rick has like the whole collection of everything Talk Boy and Talk Girl sealed. Really? Like all the way down the line. There's way more stuff than you think. Really? Yeah, what else was there? There was like pens and gadgets. Oh, really? And color variants. And yeah, they're all in the blister packs, too. He has everything? Yeah. Rick, I know a good, um, if you have a problem, let me know. I got a good person that can help you out with your top yeah, yeah. <laughs> A for me. Chris, Rick? Christo? Uh, I'd give it a B. Um, I don't know if I'd call it like a true toy toy. It is a toy, but it's like a recording toy. But the movie was great, and I used to play around with this thing. So it is still a toy. But I think of when I think toys, I think of like action Ricky figures loves and stuff. No, it's toys, dude. It toys. Be, so it be doesn't a super have to be. soaker. Man, yeah, it could be anything. All right, so I'd give it a B. All right, all right, sick. Ricky? Oh, yeah. Ouch. I'm going to drag it down to a C. No! no. Rick, a, you're right. It is just a tape recorder, and it sounded yeah. nothing like the movie. Dang, I, I thought was a you liked disappointed. It. I'm not going to lie. Two, seven, five. Uh, I, I liked it, but I didn't, you know, I, I got tired after like 10 minutes. I'm like, all right, that was cool. I your Christmas spirit. I think they actually had some illegal trouble with this Whoa. thing. Because at the time, the technology people were doing like weird things with it. I can't remember the story, but I heard a documentary about it recently where they were like, they were doing things with it, like causing trouble and saying, th oh, mm. oh, now I remember it was too many people were saying things inappropriate, recording it. So when kids come by later and press play at the store, it would say like, F you, mother, blah, blah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> so they had to legally change the packaging to where you couldn't record it. Oh, oh wow. All right. All right. Next one's gonna be Captain Planet figures. Ooh. Uh, as it. much as I love Captain Planet, I was not big on their toys. Once I learned that the show was trying to teach me things, I felt betrayed. <laughs> <laughs> I never want to learn while I'm watching cartoons. Such a good message, though. Yeah, I guess. A good message. <laughs> Bunch of hippies. Yeah, the planet. Yeah, yeah, the planet. <laughs> Bunch of hippies, man. Oh, man. Uh, I'll say the toy was a C. C? Yeah, the toy line wasn't my favorite. Even though I, I think I have quite a few of them. Anybody else? I never really played with it. Obviously, I've seen the toys before. The show is great. I love the, the show. show. It's great. one of my favorites. Uh, I'd give it uh, D. I, <laughs> I love the show, D. <laughs> Ricky? show was great. Toys, not so much. They, I, I don't know what it is about the toys. I just never... You know when you when you watch a show and you actually want to play with the toys? Yep. This never gave me that feeling. I didn't even want to be Captain Planet at all. 
I was going to say the only one you might want to be yeah. is Captain Planet. The yeah. rest were just like kids. Yeah, I they couldn't were. name they any were. of them. Yeah, I'm not the were. Any of those yeah. were. Have you some... ever seen Don, Don Cheadle as Cap Captain Planet? Yeah. It's yeah. so good. <laughs> some random, purposely diverse cast. What you got, Romeo? I'll probably give it an E. Oh, wow. Ooh, oh, right, wow. Right. For sure. <laughs> yeah. Because the, the toys kids. didn't really pop out so much, you know? Yeah. There's no, like, accessories or anything. It's all thin and cheap. Yeah. So... Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> the bottom. The show was cool. I was waiting for Ricky to give me a rank this entire time. Like, did you give me one? I'm like, oh, uh, he no, did. D. Crash them, bro. All right, yeah, they're on D. I'll, I'll make it smaller. All right, the next one will be Power Rangers. Oh, dang! Sick, sick. old school Power Rangers so too. When we're talking just like the figures, you're already you're already at like a B. But when you're talking like all the freaking the flip ones, big old flip ones, and yeah. then you get into all the freaking Megazords and all this, that tosses. I mean, you freaking. The packaging on some of their toys with like when we're talking, you combine everybody. Easy A. Easy A. I agree. Yeah, the Megazords are just on Fire. freaking believable. Um and the all the for great show, of course. Um, but the the toys themselves, like the Black Ranger, Green Ranger stuff, all that, like the swords that came with the that, Ranger. the flute, like or was it the flute, or you could play the uh, yeah, you could play the sword, the sword. Yeah, it was yeah. awesome. Uh, it's a solid A. You didn't know that, Curtis? No, I just thought he was talking about something different. What the skin flute? <laughs> <laughs> what was your what one was time? Your I rating? sucked on a big stick. <laughs> what was your rating? I gave He's it an A. It a. <laughs> Romeo, <laughs> I'm gonna give this toy line an S. Let's go. An S nice. for Let's sure. Go. The an show S. is sick. The bad guy was sick when they transformed and they got into their dinosaurs and that go go power. How Ranger. good was that guitar? Oh. So Oh, and you're talking to the yeah. guy before they go to their battles, like yeah, today, oh, you know. Oh, and then the that toys was came out. The worst part of the show was name Zordon. Zordon. Yeah, oh, yeah, Zordon. Yeah, yeah. Worst. And then you get the toys, and you're just like, <laughs> Ricky. Yes. Ricky knows Rita Repulsa. I do. Do you know the 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 robot? Uh, what's Zed? No, no. Uh, what's the little robot's name? I forgot the robot's head. Lord Zordon. She lives in my neighborhood. No way. <laughs> she goes. To, she goes like the conventions and stuff. I didn't even know. Wow. My wife was telling me. I was like, "Bro, why wasn't she at SoCal?" Because <laughs> she's expensive. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad she wasn't at SoCal. <laughs> um, oh, I'm for me. I'm gonna give this thing an S tier. Let's I go. I didn't have these, but my cousins had them, and I would play with them. I'm like, "Dang, dude, this is pretty legit." Because I was. I was older by that time. Yeah. yeah. But I still played more. <laughs> <laughs> Star Wars. Totally. Okay. You ready for this? Mm. F. <laughs> F. I'll make it easy on you. I'm getting an F too. I'll give, it, I'll, give it, I'll give it an F as well. They are, you go, if you start up a store, this is what happens to people. They start up stores and they go, we should buy some toys. And then you go to a flea market for the first time you've never been. You're like, look at all these cool 90 Star Wars toys. You can't sell them for a dollar each. They are nobody wants them. His soul is hurting a little bit. No, I mean I you're right on that. Like I still have I have these in every one of my stores. They do slowly sell for like five bucks a piece. Um, but as an actual toy, the one thing I would say is you never actually saw anybody open these up and play with them. <laughs> they were yeah. just like buying them to these it was back then it was like co not collectors. even collectors, it was like speculators. Yeah. They were like, Oh, all the 70s Star Wars toys were worth so much money. We're gonna buy boxes and cases and all of these, which is why I said there's so many of them now yeah um but when i do look at them i literally was just straightening them out on my one of my stores the other day i was like oh these things again they're all over the place and um <laughs> but i they're pretty cool toys so i wouldn't give it an f i would probably give it like a d that's just a straight up Romeo? f dude i give it the f he said f. Oh, no. it was for sure we're just going on the next one while i figure this one out all right that's a one. straight up f it's, dude like no, just well, a i guess i clicked that one jurassic park oh this line is sick this line is sick i'll say an a i actually love the jurassic park line and they do have kind of a cheap feel to them but just the dinosaurs there is weapons things shoot the branding of jurassic park is just so pretty to me didn't they take battle damage too yeah like, can you did. pull off like a lot of like their things would the come off right? like it, it would come off yeah. like meat right really yeah, yeah. that's pretty good those. i remember those look right I, there look right there the yeah. triceratops 
Oh, I and see the it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On the three horns. I That's remember being awesome. young and going to Walmart and then see, or Kmart actually, and then seeing the big T Rexes in the toy aisle and just playing with it. Oh my God. Yeah, I'll give this a C. Give us the heartwarming backstory, then just dump He's on like, it. He's like, these are all the reason I give it a C because I could C. never afford these C. <laughs> Best toy ever. Crystal? Uh, dinosaurs in general as a toy are just incredible. Anything T Rex when I was a kid, I was like, give me that. that for is a like, dinosaurs for sure. and trains. Dinosaurs, trains, trains are pretty good. Too. Trains are sick. Trucks are good. But dinosaurs, Godzilla, obviously, like. Like a T-Rex style creature yep. is just incredible. So I would give it a B. It's pretty darn good. Did you ever have a train that was like metal and like would blow smoke? The oh, line, yeah. Lionel. Those are so sick. No. Richie. I heard they're like 500 Lionel. bucks now, right? Lionel. Right? Lionel. Depends. I said it depends. Really? Uh, I'm, I'm an A. This oh, is right. awesome. I love the dinosaurs. The characters, not so much. But I did love the heck out of those dinosaurs. I had a crush on Laura Dern for sure. <laughs> Furbies. Oh, those things freaked me out growing up. <laughs> Furbies. They freaked me out. I'm going to go with an E. <laughs> I'm going to give it an F. I know. I don't really. I don't like them. I never be, did. Because they're like one of the most iconic ones. On they the are movie. iconic. I just don't want them in my house. <laughs> yeah. And they were hard. Yeah. Like they were they're hard heavy. holding them. They're heavy. They're hard. I don't even remember what they did. They what open did they... and blink their eyes and they they, they can talk with each other. Yeah, they, talk they talk with each other. Yeah, That's yeah. why they were so but big because like, they could talk. But if someone goes into your room, it'll like Rah! it'll start talking. So you so know it could recognize you. you. Like it has a motion sensor. So I think it was one of the first toys that had that. It must have been. They were hot. Yeah. Too. They were, I think that's why they were so hot. I don't know. I remember them coming out and just being like, "These are terrible." Like D. Yeah, D. I'm gonna go. E, just because maybe it was kind of cool they had motion sensors. I liked e. actually collecting them for a while. <laughs> but then, cool motion. E. <laughs> right, yeah. I, I give it an F. I have to get these and chuck these. <laughs> I actually liked collecting them for a while. No way you're collecting these? I did. And then I realized I liked money more. <laughs> so they, they quickly went the way of the willow. Street sharks. Oh, oh come on. That's another A. For sure. This Street sharks ass, are dude. fire. This is ass for sure. Street Shark. I only, I'm only not saying S because there's one other toy line on here that I can see that I want to give an S to. Although though my favorite toy line of all time isn't on here, Curtis. I'm very upset. Uh, I don't know what to do this. So. That's okay. I will give this an S. Like when you see these things in person, they are just such incredible toys. They are. They're like built. They're beefy. muscular. They're beefy. Um, they just look incredible. Even if they just put them on a shelf, they look incredible. I, I'll give it an S. Just Especially for 90s. Idea. Yeah, S. Rick, I think a solid. Sorry, my bad, Rick. No, go ahead, baby. Go ahead. Here's a solid A, definitely, because the cartoon was bad to the bone, man. They were so sick. Solid A. They were so well made as figures. Too. They were. They don't make toys like that no more. Yeah, they don't. Funko Pops. <laughs> sorry, Mikey. <laughs> Ricky. Solid A as well. I love it. I love these toys. They're great. I'll pick them up if they're at the swap anytime. Ooh, I think that ties. As long as they're cheap. I think that ties Power Rangers. Dang. Nice. That's that's good. Those that's are good. Those, those are good. good. Those are good. Yeah, those are good. Yeah. All right. All right. So the next one will be. Uh, let's go with Team and T. That's oh, my ass. Oh shoot. Ooh. That's my ass. I love the turtles, and I love how they never stop changing. I loved the sports ones, and the mech ones, and the different lines, and the cow samurai ones, and the tongue ones, and the pizza shooters, and the vans, and the. And the squishy heads. Yeah. They never stopped. Rip already said me. it. S for me, too. Ooh. I'll go S. As far as like accessories for any toy line, I think they beat anything. They never stopped. They like they're just every toy had so many different nunchucks and like different things. They were with it, swords, everything. So uh I would give it an S. I'm gonna give it and I'm gonna agree with everyone an S. All right. Yes. 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 Because it's, I remember my mom getting me a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle mo motorcycle. Yep. And it would flip and do all this stuff. And the toys were so good and so fun, so colorful. This is an S tier without doubt. And till this day, people are still collecting these. 100%. The Hardcore. And my, what's your favorite one, if you had one? Probably the... Mm, oh, okay. Let me think. My favorite one's going to be not the pizza shooters. Transformer one? <sighs> No. I like the samurai ones. Those are fire. Those, those are pretty awesome. Those are fire. 
I just think anything Mikey. Mikey's just been my favorite. That's anything what I always Mikey? get as a kid. Just everything Mikey. Rick Tell, what's your favorite? I just love the van. The van was I was awesome. so excited to get so the van. Sick. Yeah, yeah. The blimp. The blue. Because the, the blimp will yeah. always burst. Yeah, but it doesn't hold blimp. air. That's like for the most part. I it's know, expensive. but that's why it's so good. <laughs> <laughs> I love Flat blimp. I love Big Krang. Dude, oh, that oh, thing Krang. was yeah, incredible. Krang. Man. Ooh, big no, Krang. I'm going. With the little thing, dude. That thing, if you could find the big, big one, the true one, like there was so dude. many different variations yeah. of it. Dude, the but freaking the Technodrome. One. The Technodrome was incredible. So, oh, was my Krang God, so sold good. with the Technodrome? He might have been. I don't remember. No. I think or they, the, were they sold separately. Maybe the little one was. Maybe just a little one, yeah. not the full big like, thing. I don't think the full thing. one was. Can yeah. you see over there? I remember. And they also made them in different sizes, like those big ones, small ones. Oh, such a good toy line. Oh, the big ones. The big Wait, ones are said. so good. Are we going with the Legends variants? Or just are we going with the... This is a newer one, Curse, the one you pulled up, yeah, but, but I, everyone gets it. 90s, yeah. actually. Are we going for 90s? Yeah, 90s. It has to be 90s. Because uh, if, it's, if it's Legends, I'm going to go S, but if it's 90s, no, it's 90s. I'm no, going to go C. Wait, no, no. I have to keep it at an A. Which sorry. one's Legends? The new ones. We're not doing Legends. The, we're doing oh, 90s. Oh, 90s. We're we're doing 90s. 90s. Curse just pulled up the wrong image, but yeah. we're doing 90s X-Men toys. It's hard to find just toy figure images, like other than just a, one package, so... I just had to do it all in one. That's fine. 90s X-Men. I love the show so much that I I, ha I love, like, the toys were not the greatest, but that show was so good that made the toys that much better. So what's your grade? A. For me, it's a B. I didn't love as much as I thought I would. The toys. Yeah. Plus, I don't think I'm as high on the show as most people would be. I'm probably about a B, too. But really? Yeah. The show's phenomenal. It is, for sure. The show's great. I'll go C on this toy. Ooh. Toys are okay. Show was great. Yeah. The remake, phenomenal. 97. Yeah. Chris Chris really gosh, as much as I want to give this an S, because the show is my favorite cartoon so of all time, <laughs> the toys were just not well done. Like the earlier, like Kenner's lines and like the 80s and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, yeah. Some of those Marvel superheroes ones were good, but... This line was just, I don't even think You're they're struggling, on. bro. Just <laughs> say it. But I'm a big fan of our like articulation. Like, yes. And they didn't move well. I think they had yeah, stiff they arms. Were stiff. They, and so like Wolverine would be like, like this. And it was like, just say it, bro. Yeah. I'm going to give it an A. I just still have to oh, give it an A. On. You wanted to go lower, <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> they finally a. made him a little bigger, but it was too late. Yeah. Everything else already took over. I was like, oh. but you gave him an A because of the show or because of the toy? Two I like different. looking at them. I like seeing them. I played with them during the show. I was playing with them was pretty garbage, but looking he's at them. He's being wishy-washy right now. <laughs> yeah, he's, got, like, he's oh, playing politician a, right now. A, B, a, B. He's playing politician a right now. Going A. A. Oh, Hot Wheels. Hot Wheels. Hot Wheels. <laughs> <laughs> Ricky. <laughs> okay, so I'll jump in with this. Uh, Hot Wheels. So I grew up on, even in the 90s, I grew up playing with older type cars like Tonka and big trucks that were heavy and die cast that would like split your head open if you touched them wrong. So when I came to Hot Wheels, I actually wasn't really into them at all. I'm going to go D. As much as I want to go higher, I didn't really have an affinity for them. Tonka trucks were huge for me as a kid. I used to have that carpet map with like where you could put like that was iconic. Yeah, I had that in my room. Hot Wheel Ricky? Uh, <laughs> I feel like I can't give it a bad score. You, can. you definitely can. Uh, it's a C for me. I I loved Hot Wheels, but only for collecting them. I didn't really play with them. I was like, oh, dude, 69 Camaro. Yeah. Why do I got to be 69? That was the best year of the Camaro. <laughs> okay. That's what he was thinking. <laughs> I'm going to give it. I'm going to agree with you, bro. I'm going to give it a D because they're not that fun to play. I will step on them and they will hurt. Oh, yeah, it's like they go Isn't that what they used in Home Alone? Micro machines. Micro machines. Micro machines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and I did not have a fun time playing with these at all. So I'm yeah. gonna give it a D. I'm gonna go D as well. I Oof. I was never a car toy guy. Like, I, I was like figures. I like like the. We know you're not a car guy, Chris. You got a Corvette. I know. I love <laughs> <Just> cars, <laughs> but I don't. I I even had like a lot of things that's pictured there with like the wheel, and you would shoot them around and like do like the loop and all that. And like I would, I remember playing with them for like five minutes, and I'd be like, "All right, that was cool." Went around the wheel, the loop. I'm done. You're, you're not playing with like when I was a kid. I wanted to hold my like toy. I don't know how. To do yeah. Like this one, you're just like, oh, cool. Uh -oh. Let's, let's speed around here. Oh shoot. Oh, wait, we don't have to speed around. We don't need to. Transformers. I didn't know Transformers on here. It is. Oh, what generation Transformers 90s. are we at? 
90s. 90s, yep. 90s this or is so all, this guys, is like this whole segment is 90s. <laughs> uh, thinking generation like the Wait G1s. No, what about G2s, the G1s, the Wars. metals, the 80s? Beast that, that's 80s, 80s, yeah. Trans- so this, this is Beast Wars. 90s. Beast Wars? Beast Wars era. I don't know how they don't get it or hear this. <laughs> Just. Well, there's so many I had to figure Look out where we title, were. Look at the title, Curtis. Show them the title again of the oh, segment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ready, ready, ready. There Ranking you go. Iconic. Nice. No, I know oh, that. Yeah. But Ricky and I were trying to figure out G1, G2, G3. What were we in in the 90s? Oh, I think what Ricky generation? already figured it out. We did. Beast Wars. We got it. Beast Wars era. to get there. Uh, I'll start it off. Uh, I'm going to go with B. If it was the other generation, I'd go with full blown S. But I did like Beast Wars era a lot, but I didn't like the other stuff they were making with it. So if they just stuck to Beast Wars, I would have been okay. I, I don't know. E for me. Oh, <laughs> shoot. Oof. You want to know something? If it was original Transformers, it would be an F. Dang. Like, G1, yeah. like the original, original ones? Yep. Like the metal ones? You know why, though? Why? Because I could not play with them as a kid because I've told you guys before, like, when I was a kid, I could not do, like I just said a minute ago, big Tonka trucks, easy to play. Bong, 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 break things, hit things, smash. Transform. I open it once and I'm like, what the crap? How do I put this next toy? I couldn't, I couldn't, <laughs> I, it. I couldn't get them back together. I didn't have the patience. Are they amazing? Absolutely. I think there's spectacles within. They really are. But for some reason, like the, then when we get to Power Rangers, like we're talking about, I feel like it was so much easier for me to manipulate. Yeah, and put the you put them pull. those you could no actually do. I just couldn't do that. But I agree, the toys themselves are do you, unreal. Do you take toys at your shops? I do not. You do not. I oh. do not. I take vintage video games, standees, signs. Because I'll tell you, Transformers are like a curse. And I take toys, and when they come in, especially this line, like the Beast Wars ones, trying to figure out how to turn them into what they're supposed to be, yeah, I can't. Is like near impossible. Pieces. Yeah, yeah, it's like what the heck, and uh, so. The G ones you could kind of figure out, like yeah. the eighties ones. I feel like I could get, but these ones were like near impossible to twist. You would have to like pull the head up, twist the head, bend it to the left, down. To, it was like a puzzle. See, that's why I'm saying the ones that whatever I had in the nineties, I could not figure. Whether it was Beast Wars or whatever I was given, could not do it. But Beast Wars was pretty awesome. The show was awesome. Yeah, I'd give great. them a C just for like Beast how Wars cool was like they early were. CGI too. It was fun to watch. It's awesome. Yeah, I like I like Beast Wars because I like around the N sixty four era. Oh yeah, yeah, it expensive. was, and the game is very expensive. I'll give them a D. <laughs> <laughs> I just never Who would have thought Transformers would end up towards the bottom. <laughs> Seriously. All right, because um, you got me all like he's like the left, the right, the take off the head. Just because we're squeezed yeah. on time, let's go with GI Joe's nineties. Oh. oh god, I'm gonna get so much F. hate. I never liked G.I. Joe's from the 90s. I don't even know if I like the old ones. I'm not a G.I. Joe guy. Sorry, Ricky guys. And I, Ricky and I literally just got a bucket full of like original vintage, vintage G.I. Joe's, and this is how much me and Ricky know about them. We're like, all right, 20 G.I. Joe's for sale, whatnot. Go 10 seconds. Here you go. <laughs> Ten, all right, sold next. <laughs> then it look up one of them. How much did it go for? How much did it sell? I don't even remember. Like 70 I think there were the there was some that were worth quite a bit. I should have looked yeah. at those. Yeah, do you, some do of those. You sell D- G.I. Joe's at your store? I do. He does toys. You yeah, do? I, I'm, all toys. Uh, all toys. Wow. Yeah. They're they're tough though. They don't move. They're not big movers, uh, but they do yeah. shelf fillers. Yeah, and they I look assume, awesome. I assume. Yeah, yeah people do like them, and we sell them loose and boxed. I, I, um, I tried collecting the Street Fighter ones. I, I still couldn't do. It. Oh, <laughs> those are a little cooler. Oh, they're cool. they're, they're pretty much cooler. GI Joe's. The Street. I like the Street Fighter. They are. They are. Are they? Yeah. They yeah. They work together. They're branded GI Joe. Those are the movie came out. I was trying to think if they were branded GI Joe. I would. I like the Street Fighter big GI Joe ones. Those ones are cool. Those what, are pretty cool. I'm not gonna. What lie. do you Romeo? get this one, Romeo? Man, GI Joe sucks. Someone give it an F. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting so trash. So oh yeah, comment God. below. Who cares? We should have <laughs> James Joy and Personal's gonna call us. Hey. What'd you guys call it? F F F. Gal was jam as GI Joe. All three G. three Fs. You went F. Yeah, it was an F. F F F. I'm I'm gonna be honest. This is one of my favorite toys of all time. GI Joe. GI Joe. I love GI Joes. I played with these so much when I was a kid. So why'd you rank them so low? I didn't rank them yet. Oh, you didn't. Rank them. <laughs> I'm going to S on it. It's an S for me. Wow. Oh, yeah. I thought Joe's. you ranked them F. No, I did not. I was curious to see what Romeo was gonna I'm put gonna it. Make sure your hat's not too tight. <laughs> <laughs> um, I had so many G.I. Joes and uh, I loved the cartoon. Um, it, yeah, they were, I just played the heck out of these. 
Dang, they're like my, my favorites. I know it's sad to hear you guys give them ass. I'm, I'm sorry, I, I didn't want to. I just, you know, Gabo's a GI Joe guy. Huge. Oh, we're gonna have to do the GI Joe podcast, with you. dude. Me and Gabo. The readers yeah, talk up. about GI yeah. Joes for hours. It, it, I mean, talk about just jabbers. <laughs> 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 um, uh, we'll see. Let's see. If we got one more. Let's do. What did I bring it oh, up? WWF. To an, I brought it up to an E. Yeah. Right. You brought it to <laughs> <WWF>. <laughs> Poor GI Joes. WWF is on here. Where is it at? Right. Oh, there so, next to Furby's. So. Furby's, this one? Right there. Let's go. Oh, yes. 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 Solid S. All day for me. I love Wait, tell the audience. They don't know what you're talking about. Alright, so it's WWF, the Hasbro. Wait. Is this the Hasbro ones? Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to look. I'm like, Not I'm yeah. Sure. Yeah, it's for yeah, sure. it's the Hasbro ones. The Hasbro ones are my favorite like wrestling figures. I have I have I have almost the full complete set. And really? Dude, Boxed or loose? Damn. This was like uh I have some boxed and some loose, but I have the Undertaker with the coat. Nice. That's a really hard one to find. Wow. But, dude, this was like my era of wrestling. WWF, this was what I used to love. Ultimate Warrior, Hulk Hogan, Undertaker, Legion of Doom, Bushwhackers. I was like, oh, so good. Heck yeah. I love, dude, this was when they were like meaty. They're like, oh, yeah. it was yeah. big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Romeoto? I would not give it an S or an <laughs> A, <laughs> but I would give it a B, a solid B because this toy line and those characters, those are legends. Yeah, Hall of Fame legends, Undertaker, Hulk Hogan, all those guys, phenomenal. That's like when wrestling was like wrestling, you yeah. know, wrestling. Yeah, wrestling. B, Krista, I'll give it a solid A. It almost deserves an S. I mean, as far as wrestling, this is the best era. I like thought you, you like wrestling for sure. Chris. For I sure. do. Um, sure. I didn't play a ton with wrestling toys when I was a kid. I was busy playing with my G.I. Joe. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> but um, they are the best line of wrestling, best wrestlers. Uh, crazy story. When I moved out here, I wish I had never sold these. I, I, I wasn't even really hunting. <laughs> Every collector ever. I know. And I went to an estate sale and they were another. They were about to throw these things out. They had boxes of these. They were in box. Wow. And I ended up selling them. This was probably like eight years ago. And back then... They were all selling overseas on eBay, actually. They went to like, they were selling for two, three hundred bucks a piece. Um, I don't know if I had the Undertaker one. A piece, yeah, on card. And uh, I don't know what they're worth now. I feel like they're probably worth four or five hundred, like mint on card. Probably. Yeah, but But that's a good price even for back then. It was all that's a great price. England that were buying them for Mm. some reason. I don't know why. They they were harder to, I think they were harder to find in the the UK and down that way because I know there's like an Ultimate Warrior that. You can't really find over here and or over there. It's like hard to find. It's like a blue, purple, blue. I don't remember. Yeah, but solid A for me. Dang. We're just going to bring this down. Uh, yeah, what'd you give it? <laughs> He's going to bring it down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a solid A. Zero attachment to it. I oh. never played with them. They do nothing for me. I literally get most of my enjoying out of it because I see how much Ricky enjoys them. <laughs> I you gave it an it. S, right? Yeah, I gave it an S. I have to say, to me. I'm sorry, my, I just... I don't have interest in D. Do you like, do you follow wrestling at all? Damn. Zero. Zero. I never did. I mean, I liked watching the old school stuff. Wait, is it F? He said D. D. He said D. I liked watching the old school stuff. Hulk Hogan, Undertaker, for sure. That's this era. But I got out of it the minute we got into like 2000s. But I wasn't even ever super into it. Yeah. I just like the spectacle of Hulk and them yelling and going wild. Pretty awesome. So you had a favorite toy. What was it that I missed? Batman the Animated. Batman. Dang, toy. Batman animated. Dang, is pretty I would have given him a solid D. <laughs> <laughs> just to spite me. Yeah, I, mean, I, I, I would have given those an A. I was yeah, very nice. Yeah, yeah, I love Batman animated. Actually, toys. never mind. Really they did good. have the Batmobile. The one toy I'm surprised they did not put on this list is Pokemon. Oh, uh, did. Uh, that would have yeah. been a solid F. <laughs> I, I had it on there in my head <laughs> i just don't want to hear riff talk about it <laughs> oh okay so the top one looks like it's tmnt curtis or is it yes yeah. right tmnt, TMNT w- takes the cake and what's the bottom star wars good 90s <laughs> good. that was the episode one era so that i mean that's fair <laughs> yeah, yeah I, like, so. I like i can't wait for the 80s and 70s one with thundercats and he-man bring them oh, all baby man bring on 80s i'm gonna f them all <laughs> 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 so good. <laughs>